Welcome to Compassionate Healthcare Providers Educational Series. Atomy creates and distributes high quality products. Things we all use every day, such as shampoo, conditioner, soap, toothpaste and toothbrushes, beauty items, cosmetics, health supplements, and much more. And Atomy is committed to bringing these prestige luxury items to the mass market. This strategy is known as Mastige. And Atomy's concept is to enable consumers to swap brands. Atomy has an ethos of absolute quality, absolute price. It means Atomy is dedicated to ensuring its products are of a quality that is unmatchable for the price customers pay. And it's so simple to switch brand when what's on offer is unbeatable in quality and price. Remember that absolute quality absolute price quality that is as good as if not better than designer brands at a fraction of the price atomy is an online shop or shopping mall and hey it's free and easy to join and set up an account yes free to join and once registered as a member you have exclusive access to the Atomy product range. Here's the really good part. Buying from Atomy gives you points, known as personal point value, or to keep it really short, PPV. Each product has its own PV. Your PPV accumulates and never expires. You only have to make one purchase a year, no matter how small, to keep your account active. And that's no problem because you love Atomy's absolute quality and absolute price, right? It gets better. You share Atomy's secret with others, they become members, and when they shop, you all earn PV. And what does PV mean? Cash, paid to you as commission. This is a new age of retail. Atomy puts the consumers first, and rewards them for their loyalty. Although some members simply choose to shop for their own personal needs, many decide to develop their membership into full-time lucrative businesses. Let's look at how this works in a little more detail. Let's say you recommend Atomy to your cousin Jane because you love using Atomy products so much. You become Jane's sponsor and give her your ID to enable her to register as an Atomy member. Jane is then automatically registered under your A market, your left leg. Then you recommend to your friend Adam and he becomes registered in your B market, your right leg. Adam could be in Canada or China. Atomy membership is global. You, or Jane, or Adam, can then sponsor more members to join your left or right leg, your A or B markets. They are added down the line, and they don't need to live in your country either. Everyone in each of your market legs generates PV. Remember that? Point value? You have your own PV, and every day your market legs generate group PV. As soon as your own PV exceeds 10,000, earned from purchasing one Atomy shampoo or face wash, for example, and each of your market legs exceeds 300,000 each month, you earn commission. Everyone in each of your market legs who qualifies becomes eligible to receive the same amount of commission. The larger your markets and the greater the collective PV, the higher the commission will be. 
And it's worth noting, keeping your market legs equally balanced is important. Group PV is calculated on the leg with the smaller PV volume. This is part of the secret of success with Atomy. Hard work is never wasted. And it doesn't stop there. As your network grows, so does your regular collective PV. And the hard work invested takes you higher up the ranks of mastership, which comes with life-changing bonuses. You can cherish the spirit of Atomy through its products of absolute quality and absolute price. You can share the good news and reap great rewards by doing so. You may have discovered Atomy compensation videos on YouTube or Channel Atomy already. More details about how it works is freely available. And Atomy success academies and seminars will provide regular inspiring support to members and prospective members too. Alright, alright, alright. Again, welcome to Compassionate Healthcare Educational Series. Indeed. Um, quality, definitely quality products and quality prices. Indeed. But we're here to discuss the quality products. And at, we, this show was created so that people can understand and know what the product, what the products do, and how they can work for you, how they can work for you, how they can work for your neighbor, how they can work for your family, and this is an awesome thing. It's like every time we have and reveal so much about, uh, you know, for example, like you know, like the, the, like the uh, the B complex on how it's good to take that balance. We learn more than what we read on the bottle than what we see on the page. We have great doctors, you know, that share, you know, the research. We have nurses, we have estheticians uh, that share the, the research. So uh, on this evening, uh, I have a special testimony to show you on this evening, and it's about prostate cancer. And But there is uh, something else. We're going to go deep into Adamy's number one product on this evening, which is the Hemohem. The more we understand, the more we unlock the mysteries of those herbs we need to, you know, understanding this opens up even more on why should we, why we should be taking the Him or Him products. Why should we be sharing about the Him or Him product? We're going to learn deeply. This night is going to be dedicated to that. If you have any other questions about anything else, um, we're going to have to ask the doctor period after uh, the necessary videos have been shown on this evening. But first, I need to pull up um, the special um, testimony uh, that we have for this evening. There we yeah, go. that's it. Great. Uh, Please go ahead. Yeah, okay. Um, um, oh, my name's uh, Michael Dunn from Queensland. Um, prior to to uh, COVID-19, um, I was doing our, our normal um, uh, doctor's appointment and he advised me because of my age to um, get a blood test done for, you know, PSA blood test. Uh, the results was a, a fairly high uh, indicator. Uh, that's um, so they advised me to go to the hospital. So I went to the hospital, see a specialist. Uh, they decided uh, to go every three months. I was going for about nine months of doing that. And uh, the in indicators were going, fluctuating between, you know, with us for his boy, uh, blood tests, um, between nine and six. But anyway, um, so the boys me to come in, I had to get a biopsy done. So I had Eventually, kind of short, I had three biopsies. I had an MRI, a CAT scan, 
And one time in the biopsy, I got pretty crook with it. They said there was a bacteria in my blood. I don't know where that came from, but anyway, um, I had to go. Uh, I hated being in the hospital. They said, send me home with a cannula in my veins and come back daily. So, um, at one stage, it was getting pretty uh, scary there because they were uh, giving me all the antibiotics and nothing was improving my um, temperature and all that. So, um, so the last resort was they had this new antibiotic come through. So that that was okay. So now, uh, now with hemo hem, I um, just prior to COVID nineteen, I was introduced out of me by um, uh, Gloria Fishman, I think. Yeah. Anyway, um, I uh, was pretty impressed with the, what I see with hemo hem, and I wanted to boost my immune system having been diagnosed with, uh, with uh, prostate cancer, um, I bought four boxes. So I started taking them the, uh, morning and night. And um, uh, still had to go for the biopsies every three months. And the blood test, I mean, the PSA blood test. Uh, the, like I said, the first one was nine. The next one I had was around about seven. And the last one I had was down to 3.2. That's after taking him or him, so that's what I put it down to. And um, now I don't have to go uh, to the hospital. Every six months I've got to have a PSA test, so I'm very, very happy with uh, you know, I'm just taking him or him for life, the rest of my life anyway. So I just turned 69 in August last year, so I'm uh, pretty happy with it. And, um, yeah, with, I don't know if anybody's ever been diagnosed with cancer. You, uh, it's pretty scary at the time. Um, but they seem to think that it's, it's benign now, so I'm pretty happy. I'll be, I'll be taking him or him for the rest of my life. I'm going to stop right there. And do you notice what he said? You know, it's, he said, I'm going to be taking this hemo him for the rest of my life. His number went from a 9 to a 7 to a 3.5. See, you know, a 3.5. Yeah, oh, I'm telling you, we got the real deal. And he was very, uh, let's say, aggressive. He bought four boxes. Four boxes. Today I'm going to present about the Hemohem, which is the number one product in Atomy. Hemohem is for our immune system. It boosts our immune system and also it normalizes our immune system. When people have too much uh, immune system, it normalizes it. If you see the package, we already know the orange and white package is Hemohem. But when you see that green logo, it says Halal. Only in Muslim countries, it has to bear that logo. That means it's halal, uh, it's a certified halal and can be consumed for Muslim uh, population. But in Canada, US, and any other country, they don't have this logo. But in Singapore and Malaysia, they, ha they have this logo. And Indonesia will have, uh, Hemohim will have the same logo as well. What is Hemohim? Hemo, it stands for hemoglobin, which is our red blood cell. The H is for the hematogenesis. It means the production of your red blood cell. The I is for the immune system, your immunity. And the last one is the M is the modulation. It modulates, it circulates your blood throughout your body. Hemohem itself, it's uh, in one box, it contains 10 little boxes. Each box, it has about, uh, it has six sassets. So in total, it's about 60 sassets. When you take twice a day, it'll last for one month. If you take once a day, it'll last for two months. But recommendation dosage is usually uh, twice every day. The first one, I always recommend people when they're taking Hemohim, is always when they just wake up, before they drink anything, before they have any breakfast, take Hemohim as the first liquid in the body. The reason is when you're stomach is empty, your body will absorb anything that you put into your stomach. 
So that's why when you put hemohem as your first um, substance in your stomachs, it'll gonna be 100% absorbed. So once you take hemohem and then you wait about 30, 45 minutes, the longer the better, then you can start your, your, your normal breakfast or your normal drink, it's fine. For the second sasset, you can take it anytime, in the middle of the day or uh, three, four hours before sleep or before bedtime, it's up to you. But the first one is always before your breakfast. What is immunity? It refers to the ability to recognize and it destroys the, the bad pathogen like viruses, bacteria, when they try to enter our body. In other words, the ability to protect our bodies from harmful pathogens. Some of us, when we were born, we, when we didn't know that we, we might have cancer cell inherited from our parents, or if you're normal, then along the road, you, might, you may uh, have a normal cancer mutated into sorry, a normal cell mutated into a cancer cell due to your maybe a bad uh, lifestyle or you, you kind of eat junk food all the time, eat canned foods or instant noodles, use microwave, and maybe because of your workplace, it has the radiation every day. That cancer cell may happen inside your body over time. So that's why it's try to boost your immune system at the optimum level in this way, whatever that's inside is not going to be uh, mutated or being suppressed by the NK cell. I'm going to explain about the NK cell later. Or uh, the outside bacteria or virus cannot enter into your body because of the immune system. You're right. <laughs> so how does the health supplement relate to immune system that can help us? They increase the number of immunocytes. Those are the ones that enhance our, the, the function and help destroy the harmful pathogens and the mutated cells to reduce unwanted, unwanted immune reactions. Some of us, we have allergy. Allergy means we have too much immune system, like the body overreacts to, uh, to the environment. So that's why you have that allergy. So what Hamohim does, it lower your immune system to the normal le level and then it gives you immunity. Right for people that works uh, with radiation all the time, those people uh, immune system is very very low. That's why they are prone to either cancer disease or any other disease that we never heard of. It it mutate the cells inside from the normal cell into the bad cells, and then that that's why the immune system is really needed for those kind of people. It needs to boost it up. So when people at the normal level of immunity, they're really like, uh, pretty much like a Superman. Well, Hemohim itself, it's been on the market since, I would say more than 10 years, almost close to 15 years. And it's already been approved as a functional health supplement exclusive in the safety and the function of its newly developed substance. And all the ingredients, they have been approved by the Korean Ministry of Food Drug Safety as a functional health supplements. It's not only in Korea, but Hemohim itself is already patented in seven different countries. And it's been eight years for research and development as a national project. So for the first five years, the Korean government injected about 5 million US dollar to research what kind of substance they wanna uh, protect the scientists that work in the Korean Atomic Energy Research Institute. Because over time when they deal with, well, carry itself, they produce gamma cell, um, infrared cell. So those kind of people, uh, the, the scientists that work in this kind of en environment, over time, their normal cell will mutate into the cancer cell or the bad cells. That's why the, the Korean government wants to protect these scientists, these smart people to live longer. So that's how they come up with the uh, Hemohim. And then the next three years, they tested in the cancer hospitals in Korea, South Korea. So they tested on people who is having a cancer or having a going through the chemotherapy or radiation, those kind of people usually been 
the immune system is being suppressed to the lowest level. That's why they need some supplement to boost the immune system to the normal level so they can live like a normal people. Because imagine when, when a, doc a doctor, they inject you with the chemotherapy liquids or substance, it really kills all the good cells and the bad cells. When that happens, your body really, really weak. So you need something to boost them up. So what is hemohim itself? Hemohim contains three different kind of herbs. The first one is angelica radix. Second one is cinidium officinale. And the third one is peonia japonica. These three ingredients is not like from outer space. We can basically go to the Chinese uh, herbal store. You can get these three. But the only thing, this is what I know from my partner. She's a Chinese descendant and her grandparents already have uh, Chinese medication herbal stores. And she's been taking these three ingredients, but because of these three cannot be combined altogether, she only take the Angelica radix and Peonia. The reason is when these two combine with the Cinidium, the Cinidium become toxic. You cannot drink it altogether three. But once you find out that hemohim contains these three ingredients into one packet and without the toxic, she's right away um, by the hemohim and then she finally joined Atomy members because only Atomy members can purchase hemohim. Uh, if you are not an Atomy member, of course you can buy, but the price is about 40% more than what the member price. So when these three combine, Carrie, Carrie is the one who is um, producing this Hemohim, they're able to absorb or extract all the toxic from, from the, these three ingredients. So it is really safe for everyone to take it. So that means it's really zero toxicity level. So it's really safe. It will not contradict with, if you're taking medication for the doctor, it will not contradict. It will not contradict with all your supplements because this is basically like another vegetable or herbals juice. You can, let's say a broccoli juice, you can take it any anytime, right? It doesn't contradict with anything. <clears throat> so hemohim itself, it's the main purpose is to boost your immune system or to bring your immune system at the normal level. So the immune system works in stages. So I would say stage one, two, three, two, four. I add the, um, this is from the Dragon Ball. So. It's just to illustrate how the stages reacts, right? The first one is the first stage, is, which is the anchor cell, vitality. What is anchor cell? Anchor cell is natural killer cell. It's being produced in our bone marrows. For a healthy people, the bone marrow will produce this anchor cell uh, naturally. So that means when this anchor cell is in your bloodstream, it immunizes it destroys all the harmful cells directly. So let's say your mutated cells become a cancer cell. From the normal cell, it mutates to the cancer cell. If you have a lot of anchor cell in your, produced by your bone marrow, this cell will find itself for the bad pathogen cells, it will destroy itself. If you don't have the, the anchor cell in your body, what happened? You get sick easily because because there's no substance in your body will, that fights the bad pathogens. So if you take hemohim regularly, what means regularly means you have to take it every day. It doesn't mean, okay, today I'm gonna take it, maybe tomorrow when I feel lazy, I'm not taking it. No, it's not like that. When, it, when I say regularly, it has to be taken daily, every day. Even once a day is fine, as long as you take it daily. Because how immunity works is, it's very hard to go in stages. When you hit level uh, stage four, from stage one, it will, take so, it will take some time to reach that stage four. But when you're not taking hemohim, and then your environment like uh, suppress your immune system, your immune system will drop really, really fast. It's not as, um, well, the, f the rate of dropping is always faster when you are trying to build your immune system. That's why I always tell people, Take it regularly. Once you hit the stage one, your immune system goes to the stage two. 
it enhanced the cytokine production. What is cytokine? It's a signal transmission from your brain. It plays the central role in your immune system. So you're actually being able to be immune to more viruses, more bacteria. You're actually healthier in terms of the immunity. Once you hit the level three, you go to the stage three, you have an enhanced immunity. You maintain your health. That's why it's very important. Once you stop taking hemohem, it will drop to stage two, drop stage one, and then might stage zero. So you have to do all over again to build up the immune system. That's why it's very important to take regularly. Once you pass the stage three, this is the stage four, which is the final stage. It's called the immunocyte vitality. It's like the a biodefense shield in your body, outside your body. It protects you from the outside and suppress whatever is inside to become a healthy person. This is the, uh, the, the history of the hemohem. Like I already explained previously, in the beginning, the Korean government, they want the carry the Korean Atomic Energy Research Institute, scientists to live longer, healthier, because they are exposed to gamma radiation, infrared radiation every day. So that's really mutate the normal cell to a bad cell. So the government uh, spent about 5 million US dollar and they researched for five years extensively. They gather thousands of thousands of different herbals and they, they merge it and then they test it and it failed and they test it again until they found the three herbal ingredients that can they uh, combine but they extract all the toxic from it. That's how they come up with the hemohem. And then they test it for the uh, in the cancer hospital for the next three years until they find out, okay, this is really uh, works for your immune system, especially for the chemotherapy patient, radiation patient. They need some supplement that can boost up the immune system because when you're at that treatment, you are really, really weak. So your health cell and the bad cell is being destroyed by the the drugs, which is the chemotherapy and the radiation. So you need something from the inside naturally build up your immune system. So what happened was uh, Colmar Korea and Kerry, they merged into one um, and they named it Colmar BNH. So through Colmar BNH, and once they got approved by the Korean uh, Drug and Institute, the only thing that can purchase the hemohem is through Atomy because Atomy is the exclusive distributor for Hemohem. So without Atomy, nobody can uh, purchase Hemohem. So these are the seven patterns of Hemohem. There are four in Korea, South Korea, and there are four in Europe, which is Germany, England, France, and Italy. Even though these four countries in Europe, they don't have Atomy there yet, but they already have these patterns. And also the six countries, Japan, and the last one is USA. So like, let, let's take the first one, the Korea. It's been registered as an immune system hematosis enhancement and protective herbal composition and manufacturing process. And it's also the second one is hematosis enhancement and anti-radiation herbal extracts. So this kind of patents has been accrued for uh, the Hemohim product. So the question is, the hemohem is for who, right? If you are an athlete, you need physical, you need strength. Those are the ones that need hemohem. Also the housewife who are usually need physical and they are usually easily um, is fatigue, right? They need hemohem to boost up the energy and especially the immune system. Office worker who overtime who work, who sit a lot who doesn't exercise, they need hemohem as well. Student who needs stamina, who need the reinforcement for the brain to function properly, they also need hemohem. And elderly people, they're the ones that really need hemohem because at this stage, usually uh, the immune system is really low and it needs some supplement to boost it up. It's an energy recovery. Well, hemohem in Singapore is approved as a Chinese proprietary medicine. To be able, hemohem uh, being sold in Singapore, it has to be registered as a Chinese proprietary medicines and it has to have a license. 
And Singapore is really strict in terms of uh, selling a health, health products. It has to pass certain license and it has to pass the certain um, institutes. These are the labels in the, um, Singapore and, and also in Malaysia. As you can see, there's a green logo halal over there. So in order to be able to, to be sold as a halal certified products, it has to pass certain uh, criteria in the Muslim countries. This is the history of Hemohim. If you see the, on the far left, it says before 2006, that's when the Hemohim was produced. It was from Kerry. Kerry is the Korean Atomic Energy Research Institute. It's the government, um, it's the government body that, that um, these are the one that created the Hemohim in the beginning. During that years, one Hemohim box, it was sold for a $750 US. And it doesn't contain like 60 sasets like right now. It was only 30 sasets, right? And it was named as Hemo Rich Gel. It wasn't Hemohim back then. And then in 2006, Atomy was established, but that time it was, Atomy was only a direct selling company. It wasn't a network marketing. That time it was sold from 750 US dollar. It drops down to 92 dollar, 92 US dollar per box. And they increased the sasset from 30 sasets to 48 sasets. And they call it Hemohim. Then in 2009, Atomy become a network marketing. And at that time, they keep the same pricing, uh, which is 92 US dollar per box, but they increased the success from 48 to 54. And again, in 2014, Atomy uh, maintained the same pricing, 92 US dollar per box, but this time they increase it to 60 sets per box as we are having now. So these are the, the type of company they want a lot of people that can enjoy the the high quality products but not with the high price they keep it the same since 2006 until now it's 2019 they keep it the same at 92 us dollar per box but right now it's 60 sasset per box that's really a good value in term of the hemohim today i'm going to present about the hemohim which is the number one product in atomy hemohim is for our immune system Okay, okay. So that was pretty interesting there. Okay, that was pretty interesting. Indeed. Indeed. We all should be taking two a day. Two a day. And I like you, you know, how you express that you want to you wanna take that, let's say, on a regular basis. And, you know, like the guy said in the, in the testimony, I'm going to be taking it for the rest of my life. You know, and uh, and can, let's say you know, it's I want it to be a part of my system, a part of my system, just like water, uh, you know, and, and other foods in my life, all my supplements. I want to keep my body fortified. Okay, so if you want the best, get the best, buy the best, consume the best, and like you said, start out at seven hundred dollars. And right now it's 98, and we got those 60 sachets, 60, not 30, but 60. Indeed. So, do anybody have any questions at this time? You may, uh, you may raise your hand, and we can recognize it. Okay. Uh, Dr. Springer, you have your name raised, your hand raised? Yes. One of the things I was actually looking at yesterday. Um, just overall, because I've had a, I had a client who also said that it raised her blood pressure, and so it just made me curious and and begin to dig a little bit. And one of the researches that I found it gives us this information. Basically, it says that whether uh, as it relates to high blood pressure and as it relates to diabetes type two, that you will get a you may get a slight raise when you first start using it, but continue the use and it will eventually level out and bring you into a normal range. 
and it recommended for diabetes and hypertension three packs a day, okay? Um, the recommendation for immunity, for weight loss and respiratory uh, or regular maintenance, maintenance is two packs a day, diabetes and hypertension, three packs a day, and for cancer and more serious diseases, five to eight packs a day. And that was just in researching some, some stuff um, online yesterday, trying to get to the bottom of what, you know, why is it raising it? But it did say for diabetes and high blood pressure, you may get an elevation first, but it will eventually, as he just said, it'll modulate, it will bring it under control. So don't panic if that happens, but be consistent. And then um, I just want to reiterate, remember the 120 day rule that it takes for the blood to circulate out, you know, and for the new blood. So just be consistent and um, just keep watching your numbers, but everything certainly should come back into alignment as it relates to high blood pressure and diabetes. And three packs is recommended versus two. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Dr. Springer. Uh, Rosalie LeBron, you see you have your hand raised. Yes, sir. I'll back up what uh, Dr. Springer said because I have a lot of uh, experience with that, with people with high blood pressure and diabetic, because it really raised them up. But some people he don't, but some people he really did. But then, you know, they, they've been consistent on it and then he regulated. They, they are the type, uh, the diabetic and the high blood pressure. And I, I'm glad she said that for people with cancer, and then they have to take from five to eight pack of Imohem every day. Yes. I'm back on what she said. Thank you. Okay. okay. I'm trying to figure out how to raise my hand, but I do have another personal testimony. Um, I had opportunity to be down at the uh, convention in, uh, in Atlanta. Was that three weeks ago, Dr. Springer? Three, four weeks ago now? Mm -hmm. And, um, um, and, uh, well, and and I was I I, I literally was having issues with respiratory, uh, wheezing and things like that, and, and uh, feeling um, congested. And 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 I got on the hemohem twice a day, and I can honestly say that that has cleared up. So when when Dr. Springer was saying about for respiratory issues taking it twice a day. I am a testimony that that does work. And, and, and all I know is all of a sudden, it went away, <laughs> you know? So, I mean, and I understand that it addresses issues at the cell level. I get it. But that definitely does help, you know, if you have a, a yourself or a client that, you know, has issues with uh, congestion or wheezing and things of that, you know, nature, that it does work. So I'm a personal testimony with that. So I just wanted to share that as well. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Okay. We have some. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mary. Indeed, for that wonderful testimony. Very inspiring. Definitely. We have a question, and we have two questions in the chat. Someone said, if someone is pregnant, at what stage they should stop taking a hemohem stage? That was a question. Anybody? Actually, according to a court, you're going to have to use some personal wisdom, but according to the packaging, you should not be consuming if you're pregnant. So as it relates to the packaging, if I'm not mistaken, you should not be consuming. If you're already taken it and become pregnant, um, you do have to just use some wisdom because of the because of the allergy effects that um I think it's the first one um is it the main herb angelica if I'm not mistaken um and so you just have to be careful with that I think that's okay. going to have to be a personal call but according to the packaging we can only say what the packaging says and that is if you are pregnant do not take it okay okay 
But all right, one more question from the uh, from the chat, which is, what product would treat someone for a nerve problem like tingling in the fingers, tingling in the fingers? That's a circulation issue. Um, if it's nerve, it's going to be the um, plant calcium. And you want um, something for the circulation. It's a couple of things you can do for the circulation. The hemohem would definitely help. But you also want may want to do um, what is the um, ginkgo? The ginkgo. Um, ginkgo natto. Yes, because those are those they deal with circulation. Um, I, I'm curious to know if that is coming from uh, neuropathy, which is a an effect from diabetes, or is it just is 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 diabetes not involved? Is it just a nerve problem? But I am curious to know if it is from diabetes, then you want to do three packs of the hemohem a day. I still would say the plant calcium because calcium helps to deal with and heal the nerves. Okay. And you also may want to consider the apple uh, because that is good for circulation also. Okay. Oh, one Two of those things. Day. What about diabetes? Say again, Desmond. Desmond, say the again. What if diabetes is involved? If diabetes is involved, you need three packs of the hemohem a day and everything else that, that goes along with um, the recommendation for diabetes. So, uh, Dr. Walith, I want to make sure I understood you. You're saying to use the apple phenol phenom for circulation. Okay. Yes. Okay, okay. apple phenol. Mm -hmm. Okay. The ginkgo, the hemohem, and the apple phenol is what's being suggested to deal with the diabetes and the circulation, as well mm -hmm. as the ginkgo. All of those together should definitely uh, deal with that. And I really want to also say uh, that combination of that noni juice, because of what it does, it opens up those vessels, which also helps, which also affects the, the nervous system. If, it, if, it's di if diabetes is involved or, or not, that, so you have a, a combination of things there you can put together and see what works best. And we have the home run hitter called Glucose Care. Yes. I, lo I lost you there. You were, it was breaking up. I didn't hear it all. Glucose. Glucose Care. Banana leaf. The ginseng and banana leaf glucose care, but that's located in the global mall. Uh, are you familiar with the Global Mall? Can you hear me, Desmond? Your your mic was oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna leave that out there. He, he, he's on mute. Yes, sir. I heard you. Thanks. Fantastic. Okay, so um, we're gonna take Belinda. Then we're gonna go with Joy. Okay, Belinda. Um, I want to know what's a, what products you would suggest to someone that has Alzheimer's. Hemo him. <laughs> hemo him. Hemo him. Hemo him. Hemo um, him. A little personal experience with that um, as it relates to a client that has ha that deals with aphasia, uh, which for just a lack of a better way to explain what that is, is like a hundred times worse than dementia or Alzheimer's. Um, sometimes difficulty communicating, expressing themselves, and in this case, global, which means expressing and understanding sometimes. And the hemo hem um, makes a big difference. Um, uh, two packs a day on the hemo hem. The um, Alaskan uh, Omega as well because it helps to deal with the brain and to heal areas, you know, it gets to the brain. Those would be the two things that I recommend. Um, Dr. Um, Walitha or someone else may have something else, but those two definitely. Yeah, yeah I, I, I agree with those two. And I would also suggest the memory, uh, the smart memory, uh, which is in the global mall, but it definitely 
um, has what it takes uh, to support memory. Now, with okay, the memory I, I, also, up, I, I also want to let you know that this is this came on as a result of COVID too. Mm -hmm. This was not an issue. This this is not a problem until Thank after you. COVID, after this person well, contacted yeah, that's, COVID. That's because of the inflammation, and mm -hmm. that's why you know, uh, everything that we are suggesting is to quell that inflammation, which is residual inflammation. Can I ask, um, is is the person on a statin drug? Not sure. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, we want to be careful with statins. Of course, you know, I would not ever suggest someone ignore their doctor's orders, but I do want everyone to be very conscientious and study for yourself what various statin drugs do. Uh, the brain function is 75% cholesterol. And when you start lowering the cholesterol, then the person, any, all of our brains don't have anything to function with. We need cholesterol for the brain to function. Um, so, you know, just for note, be careful of that. And at all costs, try to avoid statin drugs. And really, dementia and Alzheimer's, when you go back and look, those things were not necessarily issues there were there were not necessarily cholesterol issues or um, um dementia and that until they start giving us stuff to lower the cholesterol I, I said that backwards let me say it again we did not necessarily experience uh alzheimer's and dementia until we started taking statin drugs so that's not that long ago and now we're dealing with people in the 40s you know as young as 40 something on up having issues and the majority of the time it is because they've been given something to control the cholesterol and when you don't have cholesterol you can't think you need cholesterol for the brain to function okay thank you joy you can unmute joy Hello, everyone. Good evening. Um, great presentation. But my question, my, my question or my concern is about the first, about Mary's question that she asked about the uh, glucose banaba and the person that's using it. Um, is there any way we can go back and kind of clarify? Because at one time she said, the person is of type one, type one, and then she's using that product and her glucose is going up. So, um, no, she was talking about the hemo him, I believe. Yeah, she was talking about the hemo him, not okay. the glucose care. Not the glucose. Okay, great. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yes. That's oh, correct. Okay. It was the hemo him. Okay. I just, mm -hmm. wanted, I just wanted to clarify. Thank you. No, no, that's fine. And okay. and this person is type one, not type two. Right. Okay. 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 okay thanks. You're welcome. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, it's about nine o'clock at this time. I want to thank everyone for coming. Thank you very much, Dr. Walita. Welcome to Compassionate Healthcare Providers Educational Series.